and we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanger and I am playing some Xenosaga episode 3. Yes, I dropped the save state so I didn't have the- that's why I'm wearing different clothing from the last video. I also have to record an hour so uh, I'm gonna try to get two videos recorded but we'll see. Anyway, I killed one dude. Now I gotta kill another bruh. I'm at- I'm gonna kill this guy. BAM! I mean, I can't kill him yet. I'm gonna get there though. Everyone's gonna die. Cause I like killing. I don't actually. It's just that's just the uh, meme online apparently that I'm a homicidal maniac. I can neither confirm nor deny that though. These oh. are flowers for your grave. Will you accept them? I thought flowers were Sheon's thing, Pellegree. Oh fuck. <laughs> Boost charge rate has increased greatly. Wonderful. Pelligree is preparing for a special attack. Also wonderful! Uh... It seems like a good time... ...for everybody to guard. <laughs> yeah, that tracks. <laughs> ah, god damn it. Fucking Pelligree, man. Eh, did I do it? I did it! I did it with Ziggy! <laughs> I ended up having to switch all my characters out. Because, like, everybody ran out of EP and I ran out of EP items. <laughs> so I ended up finishing the fight with Jin, Chaos, and Ziggy. Because <laughs> I just wanted people who had EP. Oh well. It happens. Let's do this. Sup, Shion? What happened? How you be? I've been recording for 17 minutes already. You guys Don't have seen about me. a minute of it. Looks like my friends have come to rescue me. That's a relief. Please, take care of my daughter. I will. I promise. <laughs> she is your daughter. Plot twist. She on. Jin. Dad. He. He. Ca yes, oh, whoops. <laughs> I know. He said he's gonna save mom. He said he'd protect his family, even if it meant sacrificing himself. <laughs> Her entire worldview is getting shattered. Yes. Father worried about you until the very end. Jin, Xi'an is at the church. I have to rescue her. I have to keep my promise to Dad. <laughs> yeah, okay. Um, it's literally, it's literally Jin. Oh, the song definitely was activated. Let's hurry. I'll return to back him now that the chief is back. <laughs> I never even used Alan in a fight. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, poor Alan. And no, I need my people back. Actually, let's... yeah. Proper leader. She's in the middle. Set leader. Everything is fine now. <laughs> okay. Two, three, blah. Okay, good enough. I don't know if these guys are gonna chase me now. Again, how the fuck did we get out of Labyrintho so easily? <laughs> Things the game will not explain. And we just walked the fuck out. <laughs> I... Yeah, and we can't just walk through anymore. We actually have to walk through the carnage. It won't let us, you know, quick travel through it anymore. Oh, wait a minute. Actually, no, what am I doing? I can't remember if the... Okay, no, it's, it's the next one. Next area. Because there's the, uh... Yeah, there's the shortcut to the church. And I love how Xion's like, I have to go save myself! I'm like, Xion should know that she's gonna be fine. I'm like, what? What even? <gasps> Hi, Momo! <gasps> Keep going, bruh! Oh hey, I wonder who that could be. Damn it! Try thinking about what's below when you're fighting. Sorry. <laughs> cause that was, cause that's chaos up there. <laughs> that's chaos and Asher. I think that actually happened in Zeno Saga too. That's a really cool like homage. Cause I think that actually happens in the second game. Oh shit. Uh, why is everybody attacking me now? 
They went from not attacking me at all to everybody's trying to murder me. Ooh, a thing. Aw. There's nothing in the thing. Fuck. Hi, can I help you? I got places to be, can you not? Okay, bye. I assume I need to go this way. Get it! Oh. I'm not sure which way I'm supposed to go, so I'm gonna go this way. Doom, 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 doom. Because I don't want to fight the giant back. It's too much effort and I'm lazy. What? What? Oh. <laughs> Let me guess. Oh. I was gonna say segment address, but oh, I guess not. Federal Report 01. Tits. Hi, bro! You wanna... You wanna turn around now, please? Thank you. I don't wanna fight you. I just wanna... Whoop! Bye! <laughs> Press circle. No! Don't wanna. Blow it up. Honk. <laughs> I like blowing things up. I didn't do it. Oh. Wonderful. Fucking you, tick. Is there anything I can see in here? Under G. Look through the binoculars. Okay. I just want to see if anything's changed. There's that. Doesn't look like anything's changed. Well, that was useless. I'm gonna blow everything up. I like blowing things up! Oh shit! A chesticle. Chesticle contains a half coat! What about a full coat? Run! Ha! <laughs> I like blowing things up! They didn't do anything about the fact that I just blew up their tanker. Uh, yay, more in-game rendered cutscenes. So much prettier looking. Uh-oh! Song. Everybody cover their ears! It is the song of Nephilim. Nephilim. It's a requiem of the end. Song of destruction. Then we need to hurry. There's not much time. Because all the realians go nutso! It causes all the realians to go extra nutso. Extra, extra nuts, though. No, I'm not gonna look through any more binoculars, damn it! No! <laughs> I'm done! Oh shit, how you doing? Uh, can I blow it up? Oh shit, dead guy! I think I'd lose my favorite spot like this, what a waste. Now I think about it, I don't need this file I received anymore, I'll give it to you! Okay, cool! <laughs> Thanks, I guess? Now let me alone. Damn it! <laughs> I got things to do, damn it! Alright, headed to the church. This can only end well. Thankfully there's a save point there, so I was able to do that. And, you know. Sure, the church will go fine! Hi, Feb. You guys might want. You guys might want to go to a safer place. Okay, thanks. Like the mines, I'm pretty sure that the, that one chick and her granddad would be happy to have you. Yeah. Probably not actually. Sure, it's noisy outside. Did something happen? It looks like there's a battle going on. A battle? The Federation descent operation. Oh, look you at these two. They're fight. so cute. <laughs> I'm not made for combat, but if necessary. I've seen Realians fight numerous times. She's not going nuts from the Song of Nephilim. Hmm. I was taught that that's what they do. That they'll kill even children without any hesitation. Rude. Unless instructed, Realians won't kill people or each other. It is you humans who issue that order. So it's all the work of human beings, huh? Yep. 
You feel different than the others somehow. Different from normal realians. It's because I'm half human. Half human? Sort of. It's complicated. She's a transgenic realian. <gasps> Hi, Shion! This is gonna end well. Shion, what's the matter? Vibronia, the sky, and the people. Crazy realians, cause the song of Nephilim. They're combat realians. This is bad. They're out of control. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> Ow, ow. That's bad. So Virgil saved Shion. Again, how did Virgil not remember Shion in the first game? Shion and get away from here. No, you can't reason with them. It's all right. Don't worry about me. Hurry. Petronia, stop, don't. Get out of my way. Get away from her. Yep. RIP! That's how Feb dies. Though we definitely see in the first game them graphically eating her body too. I don't think it shows it in this though. Oh, nope, never mind, yes it does. <laughs> Stop it! Stop it! You know, I don't think they sh Okay, yeah, that makes more sense. This isn't what you were supposed to do. Stop it, all of you. You're no better than us. So that explains how Virgil survives, and then Shion probably runs off. Yeah. Hey, you think you can run? Yeah. You run. And then Shion runs back to Labyrinthos. Good girl. Now go. Get as far away from here as you can. But don't go to the city. Here, use this key. You can get to Labyrinthos from the forest. Go back to your family. You understand? Good. Now go! Don't go to the city! Go to Labyrinthos, which is in the middle of the city. And then Virgil survives somehow. <gasps> Gunshots! Yeah. Like, I can't remember in the actual timeline of events how Virgil survived. There's so many characters, you're just like, how did you get off of Milsha? <laughs> I mean, Junior, I sort of understand. He probably got lifted out before shit went completely south. Don't come any closer. You've got to get away from here. But how did Virgil survive? <laughs> Why are you just standing there? Leave now! Hurry! Nope. <laughs> we gotta kill some realians first! <laughs> Sup, bruh? Oh, now they're using their guns. Yeah, they only use their guns in the combat. For some reason, they're just completely nutso in cutscenes and don't use their guns. Hmm? I Berserk realians! Uh-oh. This, this, this looks like fun. Well, that was easy. Well, I mean, just about. And he's broken, but he's gonna die right now. So, yeah, he did. Um, I believe this is supposed to be easy on purpose because it goes directly into a boss fight. <laughs> it is kind of funny. We were at Labyrinthos. We got Shion, and they're like, "Go save Shion!" Runs to the temp or runs to the church. Damn it! Damn it! Poor Feb. Like, we're at Labyrinthos. Oh, dad's good. Or, Chion's good. Or, blah, blah, blah. Chion's dad's gonna go save their mom. Instead of going to get their mom then, they leave him to do it, even though he has nobody with him who could protect him. And he's not very good. He's, he's not a com combat person. And there's realians and insane people everywhere in Labyrinthos at this point. So, but they still send him to go save. <laughs> But he's still the only one to go save Shion's mom. They go to the church, and by the time they're at the church, Shion's already on her way back to Labyrinthos. Baby Shion. <laughs> they're, making, they're gonna end up making a gigantic circle, and yes, I'm completely taking the piss out of this entire touching cutscene, but whatever. Get a hold of yourself. Feb died to save you. Now stand up. Damn it. Shion. What? 
Realians can share information, right? Yes, they're capable of sharing the information from individual units. Xion's in danger. I have to save her. The girl! I gave her the key to the old gate to Labrinthos and sent her running. They probably sent that information to the others. I have to catch up to her. She's in danger. Okay, grab onto me. Thanks. Bruh, now's not the time. <laughs> Virgil, why did you decide to help Xion? Is there something strange about that? I'm a soldier, but I'm still human. I have a heart. Yeah, well, soon you're gonna get shot. Like, in 15 years, you're just gonna get shot by Cosmos, so. Not like those Realian cannibals. Oh. What's wrong? Take this. What is it? It's the Realian self destruct code. Uh, how do you have that? I can't tell you that, but it could come in handy. She literally gave him shit for this in the first game, and she's doing it again. Only use it as a last resort. All right. Damn it! They're already enemies in front! Damn, it's them! What's up, bruh? Wait, how did they get in the back room? There's no other- there's no other entrance there. Xion, we're surrounded. Oh, come on! They're- they're easy. Just shoot them. That's- this Gucci. Xion, this, this way. There are fewer enemies in front. We'll break through. Xion, hurry! Just a little further. Hang in there. Leave me behind. I'm in no shape to run. I'm just gonna slow you down. Or pass him off to Ziggy, who is a gigantic freaking half cyborg who can carry him much easier than spindly little Xion. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Why are they leaving this to Xion? <laughs> Virgil, don't quit on me. We both know that's not like you. <laughs> not like me, huh? You've got that right. <gasps> Virgil, what are you doing? Open up the door now. Please, just promise that you'll protect her. <laughs> don't be stupid, Virgil. You are coming. You know something? Even after all of this, I never got your name. Her name's Shion. <laughs> See, this is how we know they're not actually in the past. This is how we know they're not actually in the past, because uh, Virgil didn't die on Milsha, and Virgil dies in the first game. Virgil. Like... No. This should be clue number one to them. Uh oh. Hi, Virgil! <laughs> yep. It's the real Virgil! With the with the freaking scar from his surgery and everything. How moving. That was so touching. Virgil! <gasps> they did a number on her, huh? Now she's just an object. Oh wait, she was already just a tool to begin with. Yeah, he got a little twisted that? in 15 years. She was years. trying to protect you. She decided to do that on her own, and then died on her own. Why should I be responsible? Virgil! What about you? You love to go on about Realian rights, but you gave me that code. What made you change your mind? I... I wanted to save you, so I... So you decided to off the Realian? Yep! <laughs> no, it's not like that. This is the complete reversal of their conversation in the first game. What are you I embarrassed about? That's basic human instinct. Humans are driven by impulse to destroy. Destruction serves as a way to feel out others and confirm your own existence. <laughs> okay. Then you try to find atonement to comfort yourself after you're unable to deny your instincts. I tried to live exactly like that. And you've lived for that same purpose. Yeah, okay, Virgil. Disassembled realians and dreamed of giving consciousness to inorganic matter. 
comforting yourself with a hatred towards your father and anger over your mother's death. You're doing things you don't want to do just to escape your own feelings of guilt. Damn, Virgil! <laughs> the word doesn't even begin to describe I think he's projecting a little. Be more true to yourself. I think he's projecting a little. What makes you think you understand me? Oh, I understand you. Because you and I are the same kind of person. What is it that drives you? <gasps> that's right. Revenge. Only revenge drives you and me, and that's the truth. Ideals crumble easily. Hope is like a mist before the morning sunrise of reality. That's exactly yeah, okay, how Virgil. I was, <laughs> but then I learned. Nothing will change. There is a limit to will. The limit of this world in which everything is closed. Yes, that is what all of us came to understand. All of the testaments. Stop! I don't want to hear anymore. Virgil, you protected me as a child, and now... Why do you do these things to tear at my heart? Why do testaments appear before me? Why won't you leave me alone? Come on. That's not what you really do. You're glad I still exist. Because it means that Kevin's real. You're happy he still exists. No, no, I... Come. Come and you will see. He's trying to take Shion away. And choose. Choose what you truly desire. I... <laughs> you met him. He's with us. Yep. I don't understand. He was a testament. I can't just suddenly accept that. That's not what your will is saying. Your heart throbs for him. You feel passion for him. <laughs> Are we not doing phrasing anymore? <laughs> you want to see him, don't you? He wants to see you, too. Seems sus. Stop talking to me. Shion, you mustn't listen to him. Yeah, Jin's probably not the one to help here. <laughs> Get him, Jin! Also, where's the- again! This is one thing that sort of bugs me with, that I've only never noticed this before, but... Concern you. Just keep quiet where is everyone else? <laughs> like, where is everyone else? <laughs> Where's Cosmos in this entire conversation? Oh, there she is! Come at me with everything you've got! This thing doesn't know restraint! Of course it doesn't. Oh, god damn it! <laughs> This is gonna be fun. And yeah, I'm again going to stop in the middle of a boss fight. I wanted to get all the way through here, but... To the next save point, but... I actually have a stream! I live stream in 10 minutes, and I gotta set that up. So... <laughs> yeah! My name is Miss Guy Tanager, and I have been playing some Xenosog Episode 3. I'll see you all in the next video.